by maybe by camera guy. I already turned it on already. You can film whatever you want. Circus, like Sean said, and, and hopefully there will be some uh, good acts, and hopefully everything will turn out. And not like two weeks ago, like there was like really snowing and stuff. Yeah, tell, and, tell a story about that. That's, uh, an that's an interesting story to tell. Ah, uh, maybe. Look, because it was really snowing last week. It was the roads were covered with snow and. That we didn't film at all. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's I was kind of uh, for me. I was just uh, just a little bit nervous, but we we still made it home okay. So, what else is on your mind? This is a chance for you to get one on one with the people, one on one with the camera, just make love to the camera. Yeah, right. Whatever you want to do, it's all it's in your hands. Yeah, that's right. With you. I mean, it's a 
like the interstate was fine, but then when we get on the, the country roads, the back roads, you know, it was kind of scary because, you know, you just didn't know if we were going to run into anything or if there could be deer popping out, you just never know. I was not ever going to touch the bikes that I would know, but, but you never know, uh, they lay at night and deer can pop out or anything, or, or somebody else can pop out, or barrels can pop out. <laughs> Let's give our special review on Kane the Game. <laughs> what do you guys think of it? Yeah, I thought it was a pretty good movie. Overall. Yeah. Well, I want you to explain it because there's some parts in there that were... <laughs> <laughs> Just don't give it all away. <laughs> so, what parts did you like? Uh, <laughs> oh, come on. You guys You guys are adults here. You can talk. <laughs> it was part of that guy in the bathroom. Yeah, yeah. I can't figure that. 
the big guy in the bathroom running really quick. Over there. <laughs> it's like, it just came out. It just came out so quickly. And then what did that one guy say? That guy should be, like, removed or something like that. Or I forget what he said, but... Yeah. It had the mu- it had muncular. <laughs> yeah. Tony, or what was his? Tony yeah. Shalhoub or yeah, whatever? Tony Yeah. That's not for the Jewish name. <laughs> Sounds like a Q-tip or whatever. <laughs> Go try some Q-tip. new Shalhoub Q- Q-tips here. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, overall, I mean, you know, it was a long movie, but it was, you know, realized that it was based on a true story and everything. Yeah. And so, I mean, I don't know if everything that they filmed was real, but I'm sure majority of it was. Besides the part where they're slapping dildo around and everything. Like, but anyway, <laughs> so who knows? But it was a good movie. Friend Larry Hankin, who I'll be interviewing next week. Uh, is in, it was in that movie. He was a priest. Yeah. Okay. And the reason why Rock was beating him up was because he was trying to hit on him. <laughs> so I said, oh, you're so, so nice and muscular. <laughs> <laughs> so you saw him, like, punch him around. <laughs> you know, that was like a stud double and everything. Yeah. It wasn't really him, but... That guy, because uh, like, after he punched him, he was like, ah, oh, dang yeah. <laughs> I almost killed a priest. <laughs> but he had a small little part in there. That was kind of cool, because since I'll be interviewing him next week and whatnot, but, uh, Overall, it was a pretty good movie. I mean, yeah, it was. you know, I give it probably uh, ten stars. I'd probably give it maybe eight. You know, I think that's fair. I don't yeah, know well, how you, I don't know how you guys rank it, but uh, you know, it, it's seven to eight. Yeah, because I don't know. I mean, they had some parts of there that they probably went a little too extreme. But you know what? If you can't handle a rated R movie, maybe you should be at the theater. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you got to grow hair on your balls. You know, sometimes and. You know, they don't always show you on the trailer what they're going to show you in the movie. So, no. gotta expect the unexpected. You can't just say, oh, this movie's too dirty. I'm just going to go watch something else. <laughs> Pay for no. your ticket. You get what you get. Yeah. <laughs> and I got an application of, for uh, the River Cinema. So, hope uh, you know, once I apply that, maybe I can get a job over here. As well as maybe possibly Best Buy and everything. So, we're probably going to go to the mall here in a little bit when Kat's done talking on the phone. And then uh, headed over to the circus. We still got a whole circus left. Oh, yeah. We still got like two hours of entertainment or more. They said there's, I went on their website. They said there's about 18 different acts that they're going to perform. Yeah. So. And you get to see elephants and everything. Oh, Tigers yeah. and bears and maybe Harold, you know. <laughs> do a trapeze act or something. <laughs> yeah, a bouncing beam or something. <laughs> like, do 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 the Clown or something, you know. Who knows? I'll <laughs> we'll get Matt Wade Osborne to come back and do Dork the Clown or something. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we'll give our little review on the Shrine Circus when, we, when we're done with the Shrine Circus. Other than that, we're just having a fun day. The weather's beautiful. What's the temperature? What do you figure about in the 60s now? Yeah. yeah, it's the warmest it's ever been this whole year. Today, you know, Friday, April 26, 2013, 61 degrees in well in northern Minnesota. I guess we are we are technically in northern Minnesota because it's East Grand Forks right now. But yeah, so pretty crazy. So anyway, we'll start, we'll see you after a bit. We'll give a review on the Shrine Circus, which will probably be a little more positive, yes, yet fun be. review because. <laughs> You see a lot of stuff we haven't seen in a long time, so. Yeah. Alrighty. <laughs> oh, but not too bad. Big crowd of people. I have my coat. What? Hey, say something to the camera. No. You look, you look beautiful. You look hot. <laughs> hey. I'll, I'll, look, I'll look at Cody well, here then. <laughs> so what do you think? First time ever at the Ralph Ingleson Arena for an well, event. Since here. John has a camera for us all, start off, I guess. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, I thought it was great, and some of the stuff that they did was really great too, and they, it looks like they practice a lot of... Uh, and you're master of the art of walking backwards, sir. <laughs> yeah, I Don't trip now. <laughs> yeah, there's some of uh, Watch out for the hill over there. <laughs> yeah, so if you look behind me, there's some of uh, free space back there. Oh, yet, yeah, so. oh, of course, yeah. Uh, but anyway, uh, I thought it was really great fun, and... <laughs> so you had a good time then, pretty much. Yeah. I had a great time, so I, I think it'd be. I'd definitely come back here next time. Oh yeah, they do this every year. I mean, it's been a tradition for God, I don't know how many years. A long, a long time, anyway. Yeah, anyway. So what do you think, then, Mike? What's on your mind? Yeah, you I want to hold this... a snake and everything, and, <laughs> and hug an elephant, and. <laughs> uh, so what do you think, Mike? How 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 was your experience? First time in a long time being at a Shrine Circus? 
Yeah, I thought the circus turned out pretty good. A lot of people, oh, big yeah. crowd. Probably the biggest crowd I've seen in a long time. Besides when we went to TNA, but I think there's more people here than there was for TNA. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, I mean, look at the crowd of people. There's Kat again here. She loves the camera. She ain't camera shy at all. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't make, why don't we make you drive you home over there? <laughs> oh. Call for a taxi. No, Sean. What do you think? Oh, I enjoyed it. It was it was a great experience, and I'm glad that we went here because you can't give up, you can't pass up the opportunity to go to the circus. You know? I don't care what people say. It's for people of all children of all ages, more or less. It's not, it's not for uh, just little kids and everything. You would always kind of desire for little kids, but but we can make kids at heart. Nothing wrong with that. Kids go to wrestling events. We go to wrestling events. Yes, you know? we do. I mean, does that make us weird at all? <laughs> no, it definitely doesn't. <laughs> I hope not, anyway. But yeah, it was pretty, pretty good experience. And now we're gonna go drop these guys off and go get something to eat. Well, head on that water puddle. Splash. Yep, water puddle. So I don't want to walk into it. That. Don't do a cannonball over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a short little water puddle. Do a cannonball in it. Yeah. So other than that, yeah, I mean, it's just been, we take a little nice to be and everything. Well, I didn't get no tipping or nothing, I guess. I thought it was going to, but... So, yeah. We're about ready to go home, or, or well, we're going to get something to eat, and then we're taking off. <laughs> so, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and... Hi, Cat. <laughs> hey! Of course, Cat. Cat sends her love. <laughs> no, you don't? No love? She likes guys who like Pepto Bismol or something like that, so I don't know. <laughs> Alright, see you guys later. Thanks for being a part of the video, you guys. Yep. <laughs>